Okie dokie. Well, as you can see, Foggy is right out there in front. Let's see if I can track her. I'm not trying to track that truck. Anyway, uh, Foggy is in the Prius out in front of me, and I am I'm in a U-Haul. Uh, I'm, I'm driving the U-Haul for my buddy, who is moving out to just east of St. Louis across the uh, Illinois line. And Foggy and I have decided that on the way back, we're going to do a small hunt. We're going to stop at five spots, and we don't know what spots they are yet. We haven't, we haven't decided. We're kind of going to do it uh, off the cuff, so to speak. So, yeah. I just got passed by a cop, and I don't know if he's even paying enough attention to care that I am holding my my visual device over the steering wheel. <laughs> well, hope you guys enjoy the hunt. I am at a Dollar General somewhere just the other side of the Illinois border. I have no idea what the name of the town is, but here we go. It doesn't look like they've got a whole lot of anything. But they got the, what is that, the 53rd anniversary one, so. Don't see anything super exciting. But we'll keep going. Well, there were a few more than, uh, than I expected. I'll be back with you in a minute. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I'd I'd call that one a win. We uh, we got some good stuff here. I'll show you. And we walked away with an ID, the Latroka, which is just as far as art car, art cars are concerned, that is one of the most beautiful ones I think I've ever seen. The yellow bone shaker with the Moon Eyes logo. The Dollar General World, World Worldwide uh, Dollar General Exclusive Camaro, which is just awesome. Uh, we got a 70 Power Wagon, which I love. We walked away with, yes, a red Big Air Bel Air, which is, again, just awesome. And, uh, yeah, that's a win. So, I mean, that's put us back about half an hour on our trip, but I'm good with that. Can't wait to get there and start moving, heading back toward, uh, toward the south end of Ohio. Alrighty, I know that I said that we would, uh, yeah, that's gross. That lens is gross. That's better. I know we said we would do four or five stops, but uh, the trip took way longer, so we're going to stop at this uh, Walmart in Bellevue, Illinois. Right? Yeah, Bellevue, Illinois. Here we go. Well, there are a few here. We'll let you know how we do. Well, Foggy found something anyway. She got the new Muppet 32 Ford. And uh, I got one too. But as far as as far as the uh, hunt, there really wasn't much. Sad. I think we might augment this video. Maybe tomorrow, I'll grab a couple of things from Walmart in our area or something. Okay, I forgot to record an intro, but Foggy and I are at a mire in our hometown. The trip kind of sucked, but we're going to root through these and see if we can find something fun, something valuable. Doesn't really matter. We're hanging out. So I'll let you know how this goes. So these are what we picked up from Meyer. This is a 
68 Chevy Nova, which makes a pretty decent impersonation of a death proof Nova. I'm going to use that for my modifications. Morris Mini, which I dropped on my shop floor the other day and it busted open and I hated myself for that for a while. <laughs> and then I have never seen a short card treasure hunt. Pretty cool. Uh, this is a power pistons from last year. So, yay! Check that out. Ready. I am at a Kroger in Burlington, Kentucky. I'm going to go in and see how we do with this one. I think I've got a few. But you know how this one goes. There's still some more here. I'm going to have to brew through. Yeesh. That wasn't a complete loss. I've got a uh, Trans Am that I can use for my modifications. Turn that into the Bandit Trans Am. Happy that works. I found Luke's Land Speeder. I love that. It's just awesome. Got Power Wagon, which is just great. I love that print. And the Ninja Turtles van. So, on to the next one. Uh, probably have Mo with me on the next run, so a little more fun. Alrighty, here's, oh, I don't even know what stop it is, but here's a stop. We're going to stop at this Meyer, uh, check and see what they've got, and we'll let you know. Here's to hoping they have a few that we need. That was a little depressing, but we did find the red Big Air Bel Air, which is a, which is a good find. I love this casting. On to the next one. So Mo and I have arrived at a Dollar Tree in Milford, Ohio. So we're uh, we're headed in to see how this one does. Worldwide Camaro is usually the first thing to go, so might be one or two in here that we actually need. We'll let you know. Where are we? We're at a Kroger. We're at a Kroger. Okay. Put stop putting your hand in my face. No, I don't want to stop putting my hand in your face. Here. My hands in your face. What are you gonna do about it? I'm gonna pick your nose. I'm gonna lick your finger. Oh, don't do. <laughs> anyway, we're at a Kroger. We're gonna go in and check and see what they've got. I think this is our last stop because we're both hungry and we're chunky folks and we want to feed our faces. Well, we we'll be back with you in a minute. Okie dokie. So that Kroger was a dud. So we found a Dollar General right around the corner. We're going to make this our last stop. We're, uh, yeah, we're hungry and fat. Anyway, we'll, uh, we'll let you guys know how we do. Well, they've got a few. And look at that. Right out front, my cyclone. Yay! <laughs> let you know how we do. Okie dokie. So, we walked away with the uh, cyclone. That was about it. That's all we found there. So, I think this little misadventure is done. I've had this video sitting on my um, on my device for uh, almost two weeks now, so uh, gonna put it up and hope everybody's doing okay. Be safe, much love, and Mo and I are gonna go grab a burger. Say goodbye, Mo. Bye. <laughs>